Hi everyone, it's Bonnie. Today we're going to do a sister wise video. Some of the things that I found out on this episode was jaw dropping, so I figured I'd go ahead and talk about that. I do have another hypocrisy of Radiant Brick coming out. I just been real busy with work, but this whole week I got off, so I got time. But anyways, before we get started, be sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell so you can get notified anytime I upload a video, and I promise I won't overload your feed. Okay, so we're going to start off with the shade of it all when Christine threw a little shade to Robin. Let's take a look at it. Can he come over and spend a couple days with us? Like, whole days. I know he's somewhere for whole days. <laughs> the shade of it all. Christine's facial reaction at the end is pure gold. We all know she's referring to Robin, and for years, many of us have been saying that Robin is Cody's favorite. Going and shopping and coming back home, and I am the only one. It's the same as the nanny, right? You have a nanny over. Well, well, well. Robin and Cody have a nanny. I think that's something that they didn't want the world to know, but Christine was there to pop their bubble and let the world know hey, there's no difference for me going shopping and this nanny. And here, let's listen to Cody trying to explain away of why they have a nanny, but yet the other siblings can't see each other. Robin and I have, um, Robin and I have an employee, we call her a nanny. She comes over, she helps with caring for the kids, and she helps with schooling. The well, we got Cody stumbling over his words like he wasn't expecting that question. He was trying to come up with a good answer, knowing there was no good answer. Let's go ahead and take a look at what Christine had to say about the nanny situation. She's over all the time. So her, she doesn't go anywhere. Her husband's the only one that does the shopping. So I don't understand why Isabel can't come over and hang out. She's devastated. What? Of course, Cody is looking more dumbfounded than usual. It seems like Cody and Robin are willing to risk having a nanny over the children being able to see each other. That is crazy. There's so much more that could be said about this whole nanny thing, but the main one being that having a nanny is not a necessity. Single mothers do it all the damn time by themselves. Cody and Robin, in my opinion, just rather risk having a nanny over seeing their family. Point blank period. And it's gross. And as if the nanny stuff wasn't bad, take a look at this clip. Hey, you're basically in, in New York or in New Jersey, you're on a vacation. I swear Cody is sick in the head. To sit here and say that Isabel's surgery was like them going on vacation when he has a nanny that is a necessity, it's like he's trying to throw anything at the wall to make it stick, to make it valid for him to have a nanny. It's gross. Let's move on. Where were these rules when I asked for months and months and months, how do we get together? Nobody offered these up. All of a sudden, the rules are being presented. It's, it's weird to me. Well, 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 it's about time that Janelle speaks up and gets her head out of Cody's ass. Those rules wasn't around months ago like Janelle asked for because it's obvious. Cody wants to be a Robin, so therefore he's not going to tell you what the rules are. He's just going to tell you, tell you you're not following them. Therefore, he can blame everyone else while it's getting to be where he wants to be. Duh. Maybe this mistake of her and I not being romantic enough is a mistake. Maybe we should be more romantic. The fact that she's choosing the boys over me, maybe it's just that mothering, nurturing, but these are adult, they're supposed to be men. So it is obvious that Janelle and Cody's relationship hasn't been all that great like they try to portray it to be. And Cody says the reason why he thinks Janelle picks her sons over him is because he hasn't been romantic enough. When in all actuality, most mothers would choose their children over their men, as if they know that's the right thing to do. But you forget, we're talking about a male chauvinist pig here who expects to be always number one. And Robin gives him that, therefore that's why he picks Robin. It's obvious. Um, but it's pretty disgusting when you end it by saying that your boys aren't real men. Like, for you to even go as low to insult your sons like that is an all-time low. Like, you are a true pig for doing that. I kind of forgot myself. I forgot the rules, and I just went in for a hug. <laughs> it was like, oops, we're not supposed to hug. I'll be all right. Just put it in God's hands and know that this relationship is more important. Okay, so let me get this straight. You're going to leave it into God's hands to make this okay. And the relationship is worth breaking the rules. But yet, the sibling's relationship isn't worth it. Like, if they've been following most of the rules and been following the same rules as your nanny, that's not okay. That's not good enough. That is uh, so asinine to say that the nanny's rules are okay, but when everybody follows the same rules that the nanny follows, you still cannot let the siblings see each other. That's so asinine and backwards. It makes no sense. But yeah, that was the end. And next week it's showing that Janelle and Cody is going to get 
uh, in a big fight, and Janelle's going to tell him to fuck off. And I think it's about time. I We've already seen Christine go out the door, and I hope we start seeing, you know, people follow. Now, Mary, I think she just, the blind, lean the blind, she's just a sheep, because no matter how much she does on a relationship with Cody, she's going to stick around, and it's just, it's very disgusting and sad to watch. But anyways, that's what went on on, you know, season 16, episode 6, um... There's no head wife. Obviously, there is. Through everything I've shown, all the clip notes that I've shown show that Robin's head. But anyways, be sure to subscribe, hit the like button, and I will have that ready and Brave video coming out soon. And if something goes down next episode, I'm going to show that too. Until next time, I'll see y'all later. Bye.